Hello, and welcome back to part three of the shore. Uh, I walked around here for a while last time trying to figure out a puzzle, a pyramid that goes up there. And uh, then, right after I ended the last recording, I saw it just on, on the beach. I thought it was a puzzle. It's kind of not. So... Welcome back to part three of the shore. I'm gonna take this, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna per we're gonna progress through these puzzles and up the hill. There's very uh, hopeful music for some reason. I'm not sure I understand, but whatever. Oh no! They reset. Oh, that's annoying. Okay, well. I guess it can't be helped. Uh, you go there. This one goes here. This one goes here. And then you switch there. 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 I cannot move. I am stuck. I am. Whoa! Hi! <laughs> what? Who is this mortal? How is it possible? Ever? Yes. The eye of the gatekeeper on his hand. That's almost the eye. It's impossible. Something greater in the shadows. Something is forcing his hand. You seek an audience with the great old one. Hmm. I... I... I do. Do I? Okay. Didn't I already talk to Cthulhu? Is that not who I'm trying to talk with? Who brought you here, mortal? How did you come by this sort of art? I made a pact with the Dark Shadow. The Dark Shadow? What? Let you straight to Well, I'm glad there were subtitles for that because uh, I would not have understood a word of it. The first cycle is broken. There is a key in the middle. Find a way to empower the artifact. Who would have known that things like him existed? I've seen one. This is the second... This is the second one I've seen, I'm pretty sure. Hmm. It's a weird game, for sure. Very pretty. This is like the sixth or seventh thing that I've just seen kind of like walk away in the water. So it's kind of, you know, lost a bit of its uh, shock value, I would say. Also, it's really weird to be playing a Lovecraft game where, like, the Lovecraft monsters give a shit about you. It's like normally my experience with the games is that they just don't care. They're like otherworldly beings that have no opinion on you whatsoever. You are just like a speck to them. That's generally how I've recognized this genre. 
Okay. Um. So it's a little weird to have them be like, oh my god, I couldn't see this coming, this mortal doing stuff. I'm like, alright. You say so. Hmm. At least I'm back on, like, the actual shore. It's much more aesthetically pretty on the shore than, uh, in all the weird little corridors filled with monsters. See you later, big butt. Hey. Is this it to the puzzle? Doesn't seem like much. Dun 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 dun. I will say that I have a little more tension because I've actually been chased by several things now and I know I can actually die. So now I'm kind of like looking around being like, I'm going on in this one. Okay. It's a gross noise to have in your ears. I don't like that. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Nope. Don't like it. What did you bring me this time? Okay, well, I saw that creepy little spider thing. Not a huge fan. Uh, rip, rip, I hear noise. Okay, that's not working. Nope. I guess this is just a run. It's not clear to me when things are just run and when they're shoot them with the pyramid beam. Well, this one's not faster than me, so that's nice. Open. What do, what do I do with this? What? Is that it? Let me in. Okay, apparently I can get through. Okay, the shift button is very inconsistent on whether I'm running or not. Sometimes I'm running. Other times, the shift button's just like, no. Nope. You're good. You don't need to run. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. Well, that just seems like death. So I don't really want to do that. Oop. I, I, I hear stuff. Okay, but like what part of this is not just death? This is just death. What am I? All right, well, I'm just going to die. I'm I'm ready to Okay, maybe this is not death. Maybe this is just atmospheric. Just just that just atmosphere. Hello, eyeball thing. Okay, you're in my hand. And you're contributing to my pyramid, I guess. Okay, you're not working. You're not working! Okay, you worked. There's too much suctiony noise. It's like very 
squidgy sounding. And it's freezing. Uh, I don't like. I'm gonna turn it down a little. I don't like that. This place sounds moist. Sounds squishy. I don't like the sound of squish. Squish is not a pleasant sound. Yeah, no, that seems cool. Let's all walk through that. That seems... Whoa! Am I faster than you? No, you're super fast. Oh, there's multiple. This isn't the right way. Shit. Ow. Oh, maybe it is the right way and I'm just stupid. Huzzah. I don't know if I would describe this as gameplay. I think I would lean towards no. I mean, I guess it's technically gameplay. It's just very minimal. It's a lot of just kind of walking backwards. Can I get out this way? Thanks, mouth. Oh, thanks. Hey, you. Shoot a beam. Thank you very much. But... Is that all I had to do? I suppose so. Oh my god. Well, you've got monster design down pat. Legitimately. Oh, hello. Uh, way out? Grab this. If I get too close to this and you kill me, I'm going to be really annoyed. Oh, nice butt, I guess. Interesting. of the fallen. They were once the sons of a elder god. Beware, they can manifest things that were and things. 
بیشتر اوکی Oh. Oh. My balls. Okay. Where where are you? can manifest all kinds of things but very specifically just these these things over and over again oh hello you got kind of close I guess am I done Sure. Why wouldn't I do that? As the universe itself unfolds before your very eyes. The watcher, the dead giver of wants and dimensions. Kinda big. Gonna land on us. Uh-huh. I kind of would like my pyramid back. It's sort of my only defense. Hmm? Mm hmm. The more tentacles, the more powerful tentacles are power. say this feels really far removed from my daughter. Hello. She's beautiful, the perfect girl. That's what we ask for. We should name him Andrew. Yeah, I'm born. That is a part of my memories. A very important one. Okay, well, my mom looks weird. Get the baby. Entity. Accept this boy into your possession. Accept this offering. Grant us an entry to your realm. Sure. Parents sacrifice me. Not a lot of emotion behind their sacrifice, but you know. Dad? Mom? I'm lost! <gasps> There's a monster here! Mm-hmm. Mm hmm. I'm learning a I thought these were going to be more about his daughter, but maybe we'll get there. He finally have a long house. This will be the perfect place to raise his son. Uh huh. My, I think this is supposed to be my wife. She sounds remarkably similar to my mom. I'm just going to walk up on this bed. Sorry about that. That she is. You know, I was thinking of getting out of the fishing business. I can't imagine leaving you for months while you have to raise our child alone. What if something happens? We'll see about a job in town next week. 
A, feels like something you should have considered probably before the kid. Uh, and B, why are you so much louder than she was? I could barely hear her. Breathe. Breathe. Stay with me. What do you think about all this, Mr. Bird? Pretty heavy stuff, huh? You look really out of place here. Do you work for... Uh... Mr. Tentacle? Alright. Unknowing, that one. Unknowable. Too smart. Okay. stuff in the boat, Ellie. Fishing trip, you say. You sleep on this tiny little boat as a part of your fishing trip? That looks like a day boat, if I might say. Is that you? Ellie, stay right there, I'm coming. She's not your daughter, Andrew. She was never real. What? What do you mean, she was never real? Since the beginning, I felt that the only way to enjoy this boring reality was to change it. But I was in need of someone. Someone with purpose. You see, all the people I brought to Kynet had no purpose. No meaning. But you, Andrew, you are my favorite. I made those memories for you. I created a daughter that you never had. I was always there for you. No. 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 It's not possible. Stop. Lying to me. I did what you asked for. I'm getting her back. Perhaps there is still a way to make her real if you manage to reach her. Your strong will can influence Azathoth's dream. Uh, what did you do to me? I'm confused. I thought that that mask guy, he showed up once before. I thought he was different than the voice that had been guiding me. I thought he said something along the lines of like, don't be fooled. But then he's the final person. Oh, and that was the end. Hmm. Hmm. I'm like really torn. Because I think the monster designs were really cool and interesting. And like the actual beach ambiance and atmosphere and music were cool. But the gameplay was so repetitive. If there really was gameplay. And then the one thing that was really the coolest thing was seeing the giant monsters walk across like the ocean, how impressive those were. But then it happened so many times that I don't know. And the story felt really disconnected. It's like we ran into Cthulhu once and then ran into him again and acted like we had never seen him. I don't know why Lovecraftian games feel the need to throw like every God's name at you all the time in every game. It feels just unnecessary. You could just have one. I don't know. Like an A for atmosphere and music and like monster design for sure. 
But then everything else, I don't know. It was good. Just, it got a little tiring at the end. And uh, I'm not sure it had the emotional weight that it was that it was trying to go for. But I'm glad I played it. I hope they make more games because they've definitely got the aesthetic down if they just add some more gameplay and maybe some more story development because it was a very cool atmosphere and I'd like more of that. So I guess with that, uh, thank you for watching. Um, I'll play more Lovecraftian games. I really like Lovecraftian games, even if Lovecraft himself was a bad guy, <laughs> but I like the games. Yeah. Thank you. Bye. I will wait here and see if there's an extra scene at the end that maybe ties it together. No. Okay. Oh, as a side. Oh, I can click on things. I want to click on you. Oh, I can't click on things. I thought I could there. What was with this? Uh, maybe I don't know that book. Why is this fish guy climbing this pillar and using it as can he can the fish man not swim? I don't remember that. I've been a long time since I've read the stories and I haven't read all of them, so I have no clue. All right, that's actually it. Thank you for watching. Bye.